All right, it's the morning rad race from Jersey's Rad Radio, 95.9 The Rad. Dave's going to do quick sports for us, get us ready for the weekend. What's going on, Dave? Okay, let's start with football, where the Steelers beat the Titans on Thursday night football, 20-16. to 16. Good, I took them. You got the Steelers at WRT.com? Yep. Football pick em challenge now in the in the next week uh, fully, thanks to Ross Brewing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Steeler receiver Deontay Johnson caught seven passes for 90 yards and a touchdown. For Pittsburgh, so you might want to think about him for your fantasy football team next week. Steelers improved to five and three. Titans dropped to three and five. Now football this weekend in our area, four twenty-five on Sunday. Got the Giants two and six taking on the Raiders three and five in Las Vegas. Daniel Jones expected to get the start. Mm-hmm. They haven't really made it official. Official yet? Uh, I'm going with the Raiders, even though I think the Giants can win this. I just want to crap on the Giants one more time. <laughs> I took the Giants. Oh, look at I'm you. going with the G-Men as well. Yeah, I feel I like the coaching the change in the Raiders may get this this team to actually do something. Maybe. Different. Yeah, especially the crazy thing is Antonio Pierce, uh, the uh, former Giant, getting the uh, coaching job in Las Vegas. Mm-hmm. If I may, I tried something last week over at Bar A because I host there on football Sundays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I, uh, I said, listen, I'm going to let the audience here at PBR Bar A, I'm going to let you do my picks this week. Oh, really? So, I, you know, I have you come up. Oh, that's a fun the thing. I for the prizes, and I go, which team should I pick this week? You know, this this time, this you know, this day. Yeah. This How'd you do? I think I did 10 out of 16. Not days. bad. That ain't bad. That's good. That, that that's bad. pretty good. Yeah, all right, good job. Um, 425 on Sunday as well. You get the Eagles against the Cowboys. Philadelphia, big NFC East matchup. Philly 7-1, and one, Dallas 5-2. and two. That's a big game right there. Cowboys definitely need to uh, get the win because Philly's really had their number. I mean, Eagles-Cowboys, that's the matchup, right? Good stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, def- definitely a game I'm going to be interested in, even though it's going against the Giants game. I'll probably be watching just as much Eagles-Cowboys. Monday night football, the Jets play the Chargers at MetLife Stadium. Jets are 4-3. and three. L.A. is 3-4. and four. Just need that big D to step up. Got You guys uh, have to solve Justin Herbert. The L.A. Chargers quarterback, but if you can, you'll be in good shape. I, you know, uh, we just need a few. We need a few field goals. So yeah. I think uh, the final score twelve to ten. Twelve to ten. <laughs> All right, gonna win. All right, fair enough. Come on, man. We beat the Eagles, bro. Let's go on. <laughs> Basketball we the couldn't seven- score a damn touchdown last week. Well, <laughs> save our lives. Yeah, happens. Seventy Sixers dominated the Raptors <laughs> last night, one fourteen to ninety nine. Joel Embiid. Had 28 points, 13 rebounds, 7 assists in the win. Sixers now 3-1 and one on the year, undefeated since James Harden left the team. Joel Embiid physically looks a lot happier since Philly traded Harden to the L.A. Clippers. The Knicks and Nets were inactive. Tonight, the Knicks take on the Bucks in Milwaukee. The Nets play the Bulls in Chicago. Hockey, the Devils defeated the Wild yesterday 5-3. to three. They're looking good out of the gate. Jesper Bratt had a goal and 3 assists. For the Devils, now 6-2-1 for the year. The Rangers beat the Hurricanes 2-1. William Cully scored the big goal for the Rangers in the third period. And they are 8-2. and two. Wow. So the local teams playing well out of the gate in hockey. Flyers were off. They face the Sabres tonight. And baseball, World Series is over. That means the free agency period has begun. Shohei Otani headlines the class. Could the Yankees go after Otani? We'll see. Didn't he end the season hurt, though? He did, yeah. and that's one of the concerns is that he he was he hurt he got hurt pitching. Well, he might not play on both sides. So, well, the, his agent says he wants to play on both sides, and the yeah. reason why the agent is saying that so he can get the most money so humanly he can get possible. The cash, yeah. He's looking to see if he can even get sixty million a year Whoa. for Otani. So he wants Otani to pitch. Wow. Basically, he's yeah. advertising him as sure. a double threat. But that is a concern. And that is your quick look at sports.